We got a new Miranda hairstyle and I'm actually inspired for my let's play. I won't use this armor right now. I will switch it out in a second. It's too cool looking for this unimportant walk. So I will take one of the armors that I actually don't like right now. Like those three. Jacob has very cool stuff. Playing too much. That. That. And I will probably get rid of those armor mods for Miranda that I actually don't like visually. Uh, she looks like a pirate now. Doesn't quite fit, you know. You know. But for this little alien port here. Does living at a higher altitude make you more intelligent? Our report may surprise it makes you. Makes you more athletic. By the Architectural Union. That's for sure. Between tested intelligence and I'll give you a short sell on the new bags after these new human colony attacks. They're going to see a ton of business. Freeze. Bro, because so many got them aliens. Holy crap, Shepard. I thought you were dead. Shepard? The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. It's been a couple of years. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You helped me nail Administrator Analeas. Happy to help. What happened to Administrator Analeas? He made the one mistake Novaria won't tolerate. He got caught taking their money. He's doing a few years in white-collar prison. More importantly, he won't work in the field again. Sit down. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. You ever heard of the Collectors? They're attacking human colonies. I'm gonna stop them. Damn, Shepard. For me, a tough job involves more paperwork. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've gotta go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. There's nothing in there. So that's a card underneath it. Salmon the beer. Shepard had to leave. Target saw me. Couldn't break cover. I saw a merchant smuggling schematics from Novaria. Can you talk her into showing you good stuff? Hmm. Oh, I want to see good stuff. And I want background music. Do you have yeah. anything flashier? Yes, flashier. I want flashier. something that says, I owe you. Welcome back. Just so you know, your discount is still good, and I'll let you know about any special items that might hold your interest. What kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, That's... schematics, designs. Nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. Do you have anything else? Anything not listed on your main merchandise kiosk? Well, there is one thing. Very advanced design. Not publicly available yet. That's because it's still in development on Novaria, and illegal for export. Hello, Hermia. Parasini, you set me up! But this isn't Novaria. You don't have the authority to arrest me. I don't care whether you go to jail. I've got all the evidence I need to find you out of business. Do you have the authority to seize the schematic she's trying to sell? I don't have to. Hermia was under suspicion. We leaked a faulty device to her. All this thing will ever do is blow up in your face. I, I need to go. I have to talk to my lawyer. Talk fast, Hermia. When the fines hit, you won't be able to afford him. Ah, oh, that was good. I've got to go file a few papers. Come by my table when you've got a minute. Ah, <sighs> feel dirty. Is there something good in here now? No. How much? I need to save money. Oh, Omega, pretty good stuff. Damn it, don't press on it again. If this is the best you have, I'll make do. But you're certain the neural stimulators are compatible? I don't need to go up there yet. Absolutely. In fact, I use this model at home, sir. Oh. Hermia is going to be a very poor woman very shortly. Thanks for the help, Shepard. I Amy. love nailing a sorry. So ageless and superior. Then you get them and they squeal like schoolgirls. Uh. It must be nice having a job that you really enjoy. I wanted to be a cop or C-Sec, but my family had bills. I needed the money a corporate job brought in. 
Besides, in this job, you don't see things that make it hard to sleep at night. White-collar crime is nice and clean. Hell, at least this time I didn't have to wear heels and a dress. How'd you end up on Novaria, anyway? Scholarship program, and a competitive internship. Turned out I was only middling at the science, but I could always ferret out secrets. You grow up poor and surrounded by rich kids, you get good at hiding yourself. Helps with going undercover. What's up next for you? Research. We've had some hacking attacks lately, and I want to make sure they're external. A lot of people are suddenly interested in dark energy. My bosses want to know if it's something to worry about. That'll hold me over until I have to go back undercover anyway. I think they forgot completely about dark energy in Mass Effect 3. It must be hard going undercover so often. It's not so bad. Go new places, be new people. The only weird part is when you go home and try to talk to people, and you forget how to react. Like it's another cover, you know? Deep down, part of you likes fooling people. That's what makes you good at it. Part of me, yeah. I grew up poor and working class. Now I walk around the rich and powerful, taking notes, getting evidence. And they never see me coming. It's been a pleasure, Gianna. You too, Shepard. See you around. Dark of music is killing the scene. Okay, is that Nero's office? No, it's upstairs, isn't Ilium it? Is the gateway to the traverse. But is that gate open too wide? Invest Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. You're Liara's assistant. Yes. Liara relies upon me to acquire useful intelligence. I don't have her network of contacts, but I supply her with supplemental data. It's really an honor to work with her. What's Liara's reputation here on Ilium? She is greatly respected. In a few short years, she's amassed a sizable network of connections. She could have even more political power than she already wields, if she weren't so focused on her personal goals. But I believe she should tell you about that, not me. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. No, I will not. Not that outfit. We just need an eye patch. Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. <sighs> Shepard. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. You have sources now? A few. Sources, contacts, even a little hired muscle. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back, gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. That's not exactly public knowledge. Neither is you being alive, Shepard. Information is my business now. And if you need information on finding people, I'm happy to help. Join me. What about you, Liara? I could use your help on this mission. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here, things I need to take care of. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. What's this all about, Liara? Can't you just talk to me? Don't you think I want to, Shepard? This isn't because I don't trust you. This is Ilium. Anything I say is probably being recorded. Hacking a terminal sounds pretty easy. Why do you need me? I don't know anyone else I can trust. Hacking the security node won't get you the data. It just creates a minor glitch in the system. You'll have a short time to find a local server left vulnerable by that glitch and upload the data to my system. 
I'm leaving my own system vulnerable so that the data can be imported during that short time. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. God damn, my hands were totally glitched. I'm looking for Thang Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. That was all just off the top of your head? I'm a very good information broker, Shepard. The world of intrigue isn't that different from a dig site. Except that the dead bodies still smell. Mm. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with tracking officer Dara. You can find Dara at the transportation hub. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. How's your own work going? Everyone needs information, Shepard. You want to know why I don't drop everything to join you? I need to get that data. It should be about friendship or trust. But that's not the way it works on Ilium. Let me know when you hack those terminals. Give me that, and I can talk to you. If it'll no, help, thank the, you, Shepard. The, 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 um... Nope, I could take a screenshot. I mean a photo. Damn it, let me behind the task, Liara. Oh, bastard. Bastard. Oh, the mod. Let's just photo pump her like that. Yeah, it's decent enough. Bam. Bam. This is a recall notice. All users of Coros brand medical radiation systems are asked to discontinue treatment immediately. Please return your system to an authorized dealer for a refund or for credit toward the exciting new Coros brand radiation personal defense weapon. Customer safety is important. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Corosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky Coros. I got out at all. Her mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. Damn, it's crowded here. Say, William. No Sastra. That's for the assassin. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do the other Hungry. stupid little egg game. To the fish dog food shack. Tasty fare and skewers are just five credits for a limited time only. Or Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know, some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger means more contract work for us. Come to the fish dog food factory. The division of Elcos Combine. You're sure, Gateway Weapons? Oh, blue rose of Ilium. Let your roots dig deep into the hot soil of Tachanka. Hot. Let our scorching sun and sheeting rain turn your supple beauty into no. strength no or is Save money. what about you going to try and make it as a commando oh that's good though oh i don't have that heavy skin that's good though and i'm already broke why not oh. every asari has biotics might as well use them right Damn, that's a hell of a sniper rifle. If you oh, say so. Where? I'm telling you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse mercs, some just a car, I don't know. Nobody is ever going to see the extra merchandise, which is why we're going to be rich. No, I haven't had any luck yet. She insists it was legal. I don't know. I'm going to call in a favor and have a friend examine the For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. I'm on a call. Where? Yeah, up here. Dumb. Let me just 
the run there, please. Hurry up. God. Stupid stuff like that. There it is. Shepard, this is Liara. I've got the data. Come see me when you've got a moment. Another time. Another place. Shepard. I... I don't suppose you'd remember me. I'm Shiala. We met on Pharos during the Geth attack. Saren had given me to the Thorian creature as a slave, and you killed it, and saved me. I promised to help the colonists recover after Zeus' hope was lost. I'm actually here on Ilium for just that purpose. Where did the survivors go after Zeus' hope shut down? A few went to new colonies, but most went to Earth. The Exogeny researchers got called back to their headquarters, however, along with what was left of the Thorian. Actually, only one person survived. Is it Exogeny pushing colonists around again, or did the Thorians somehow survive our fight? No. Exogeny has had little contact with the survivors since the death of Zeus Hope. We hope to keep it that way. And the Thorian is dead. Though, after all you went through to kill it, I understand your concern. I fear that after our adventure on Pharos, my purpose on Ilium will seem mundane by comparison. Is there something I can do to help? I'd appreciate it. I've reached the limits of my diplomatic abilities, and I prefer not to start trouble. Some of the colonists had health problems as a result of the Thorian control. We hired a colonial survey group to do some medical scans, but the medical contract apparently allows the company to perform invasive procedures without our consent. That's why I'm here. Why are you green? Wait a minute, Shiala. You were only green when the Thorian made you a clone. The real you was blue, like normal Asari. Those health problems, I said, were related to the Thorian control. This is mine. A few months after the Thorian died, my skin pigment changed. My biotic abilities are unstable as well. I'm also having vivid dreams about my time with the Thorian. It is disconcerting. What kind of health problems did the colonists have? Headaches or muscle spasms similar to what they experienced while under Thorian control. Sometimes the colonists near another former Thorian victim shared sensations like heat or pain. It has to be a result of trace amounts of the Thorian's parasitic spores. You can see why we'd want it studied and cured. I let only one person survive. They had multiple ones. Tell me more about the contract you signed for these scans. Barrier Frontiers was interested in our problem. They offered to perform medical scans and deliver treatment for next to nothing. I should have known it was too good to be true. But we were desperate. In the fine print, we apparently agreed to let them perform invasive follow-up procedures if they deem it valuable. Which they have. Can they actually force these procedures on you? No. But they can declare us in breach of contract, which means we're responsible for the full price we would have paid normally. These people just lost their colony. They can't afford that, Shepard. I'll talk to the survey group. I appreciate it, Shepard. The Barrier Frontier's representative knows about the issue. Okay, safe. This is gonna take a while. This is just... Gonna take forever actually. Um, uh, see the time. 18 minutes, 19 actually. So oh, it's probably gonna take five minutes away. Away. Off the way. Okay, sure. I saw your conversation, human. You're here to complain about the medical contracts those colonists from Pharaoh signed. I suggest you leave. Your life is short enough. Do not waste what time you have bothering me. Why are you insisting on these tests? What use could they possibly be? Their use is not your concern. A legal binding contract was signed. Nothing else matters. All of you. Humans. Salarians. Turians. You come to our planet, then complain that our laws don't suit you. The galaxy would be a better place if nobody but the Asari had ever dragged themselves out of the primordial muck. Oh. 
Why are you so prejudiced against aliens? Phew, where do I begin? With Salarian explorers unleashing the Rachni upon us, then unleashing the Krogan to correct their mistake? Or the Turians, so eager to bomb every problem away? Or humans, the new arrivals who already think they should be in charge? Every war that has plagued this galaxy has been caused by your people. My people's deaths are on your hands. Whose deaths are we talking about exactly? The mother of my daughters was killed on the Quarian homeworld during the initial Geth uprising. My daughters died on the Citadel when the Geth attacked. One worked in the embassy. The other was a greeter for the consort. I'm not speaking in hypotheticals, human. The aliens will never be my allies. The best they can do is give me useful medical data. Why was your bond made on the Quarian homeworld? Studying the Quarians. Not their technology, but their music. She loved all their art. Said they had old souls. I think that's where my daughters got it from. Both of them love talking with people, exploring new cultures. They sound like wonderful people. The galaxy is lesser for their loss. Yes, it is. Do you think they'd want you to do this? I I'm not. I, I didn't. Oh. Ball bumper. Good. Oh. I'm. Sending an amended contract. No more tests, no fees. There's enough grief in this galaxy. I don't need to add to it. Okay, I did remember the shortcut version. Oh no, no, no. I just got one rope. Did you get the star charts? Yeah. I had to deal with Arinya though. I feel like I need a shower. What do you expect? She's a pure blood. They're all like that. Yeah, she the worst. You did it. I just got the revised contracts. Thank you, Shepard. You saved these people a lot of additional pain. I don't think I could have... Is it always like this? Yesterday's problems lingering in some new form. Isn't anything ever just fixed? You've got the power to make a difference, Shiala. Not everyone does. We don't even have a colony anymore. Just scattered survivors. I was a commando, not an organizer. But I'll try. Thank you for what you've done here, Shepard. I'll keep doing what I can. Paragon, that should be more Paragon. Office and Dara. It's safe. Get to the place, but not start the full mission. Just talking to the people there. About meeting Samara. Will be the next part. Um. Okay. So. Oh no. Oh no. What did I do now? Okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Maybe we need to just it's go just, back. We're looking for Blue Rose uh, Amelia. Talk to her. What do you huh. want? Sorry, sorry. That damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. Is that Krogan bothering you? No, no, you don't need to hurt him or anything. He's oh, harmless. Which Amelia. I know, Krogan, so Let it's hard to believe. His name is Char. Soil. We're kind of Chaka. dating, but, well, we're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. Oh, I don't care. It doesn't seem common for a sorry to date Krogan. What brought you two together? He's a fun guy. Really smart. Especially for a Krogan. And he's got a good job as a transport technician. It's fun to join a mercenary guild or dance at bars for a few centuries, but eventually you hit the matron stage, you know? Then you get your back tattoo removed, let your scalp go back to its natural blue, and settle down with blue someone dependable. You have blossomed in a tower so why are the two of you on a break? 
He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. <laughs> uh, no offense. Uh. It made me wonder if he really likes me, or if he just wants kids. He can't have them any other way, you know, because of the genophage. That sounds like a question you should ask him. I did. I don't think he realized that our kids would always have been a sorry. Nanasari don't always get that we're not taking alien DNA, we're just using it to randomize some of the genetic information. Anyway, Char was quiet for a long time. Then he said that he'd love our girls no matter what color they were. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Look at him, he's obviously crazy about you. Is he? I mean, what if he just wants to have kids? Am I just his baby-making machine? He said I wasn't, but... If he said that, then you either trust him so you have nothing to worry about, or you don't, and you've already decided. I, I guess I hadn't thought about it like that. And I do trust him, if he said it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. I don't know which one. Is it the one I already bought stuff from? Oh, or is it the fish? Is it the fish? I don't need the fish. I'm not a fish guy. Eclipse might be fun for you. For me, it's the future. My clan's breeding strategy is at stake. The store's over there. And don't get cute. The whole place is monitored. What the hell should I steal? It's... Oh, anyways. Anyways, it's you not like the gun's lying on top of it. Customers. It's like she's oh. turned pure blood into her religion or something. I well, heard shooting she lost stuff. her daughters when the Geth attacked the Citadel. Right, I'm sure... You can sell something that dangerous with just a contract and a waiver? These are the Terminus systems. Everything's dangerous and everything's for sale. Scale looks. Either we Mine is so gangly and, and asymmetrical. You want to know a secret? A I had it done a few years back. Oh, I cannot talk to her. Huh. Serena? Who wants to know? That's weird. Name's Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Where is he? Maybe you could help me find him. <laughs> I can tell you, but you won't stop him. When he contacted me, I checked up on him. The man never gives up on a job. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Who is she? A wealthy speculator with a nasty disposition. She's killed her business rivals, government officials. I heard she even took out her own sister. If anyone deserves killing, she does. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. It doesn't sound like Nisana's just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. You're just offering your help. No strings attached? You're going to look for Thane. Nisana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. 
If he takes down Asana, I don't care why he does it. I'll be back in a bit. I'll be here, but I wouldn't wait too long. I wanna see if I can start that goddamn other quest. I don't know why it's glitching. This let's play is cursed from the start. Teamwork, confidence. When you join the Blue Suns mercenary group, you're getting a crash course in life. Join I don't know, today. that still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. Program. All the dangers are right there on the package. It's legally required. Who reads labels though? So consider it a way to weed out the people too stupid to know their <laughs> limits. Why I need to check why this mod is glitched. Fast travel here. Sometimes you say these things, and I don't know. Maybe it's because you. I'm on a call. So I didn't want to talk to you, anyways. Can I? Bastards. Can I jump off? <laughs> oh, that would be weird. God, I hate that outfit. Yeah, cut it. 